It's been nearly a week after Hurricane Michael blew through, but the Elkmulgee Electric Membership Corporation says it's still working to get power back on for some customers. Now, that includes folks in Dodge and Blakely counties. Pepper Baker talked with neighbors in that area to see how they're coping with life in the dark. I'm here at the Okmulgee EMC office in Eastman, and they actually have a sign on the door that says that they're closed because they're out servicing customers who are still without power from Hurricane Michael. And after six days in the dark, people are worried. Uh, my mother's 91 years old. Uh, she's dependent on electricity. Gary Raffield is helping his mother after a large tree knocked over a power line, causing her electricity to go out when Michael raged through central Georgia. That was six days ago and she's still in the dark. The guys, I'm sure, are working so hard that uh, so many devastation of other, of other people that uh, they're supposed to get it on soon, my understanding. The tree also damaged his mother's well. She and her neighbor have also been without running water. Next door neighbor Wayne Tripp is 74 years old, and he says living like this is a struggle. It's been rough. I have a medical condition that I have to have a CPAP. There's three others on this road that's got medical conditions. And there's 20, 20 houses on this little stretch here. He said he's been in contact with Okmulgee EMC and is still waiting. I talked to uh, OEMC this morning. They said possibly today but no warranty on it, but uh, we need all the help we can get. I realize other folks have got problems, but uh, we do too. Both Raffield and Tripp have small generators running to hold them over until Okmulgee EMC can get their power back on. We've reached out to manager Jeffrey Underwood about updates on the power outages and are still awaiting a response. In Dodge County, Pepper Baker, 13 WMAZ News. Okmulgee EMC services about 7,600 customers in five counties, including Dodge, Bleckley, and Lawrence. Again, we could not reach them to ask how many customers are still without power. Georgia Power said all of their customers in the area have their power back on.